Hey y'all, so day two um, with sharing a quote from my book with everybody. Today's quote has to do with um, there being a dynamic relationship between the prosperity of the soul and the physical body. Over the years, I have been learning as a believer who loves to hear from God and to know that God hears from me. Um, I've been listening to his lessons when I experience good things and bad things. And since I am highlighting the quote today about the relationship between the prosperity of the soul and the physical body, um, I'm starting to understand from God how the way that one we treat our bodies um, shows us how we see him additionally in my candor and my questioning to god i ask him when i'm experiencing something that's a physical challenge some things chronic some things uh, temporal um, he's begun to show me that he's teaching me some things about his body about the church that um, through the experiences that I have physically. And me being patient enough and me being submissive enough to talk to him about these things. I'm also learning and seeing that many of us want physical prosperity and we want financial prosperity and what other, the other kinds of prosperities that people desire without prospering in our souls. And to me, that just doesn't make sense. Um, yes, I am a believer, and so I've been educated in a particular way, which is, I believe, the most important way because the person who made me, the person who created me as a soul, is the God of the universe. So what sense does it make for me to try to live other than him, to try to live outside of him, to try to live apart from the roadmap that he has for me to follow? It just doesn't make good sense, and it's a waste of time. And that is the crux of my book regarding just being because in just being, I um, believe it critical to ask the person who made you who you're supposed to be and how you're supposed to be. Uh, so particular to the quote that I'm highlighting today about there being a, a dynamic relationship with the soul and the physical body, I've been learning to seek God about what's going on with me definitely not excluding professional medical advice by any means because he created those people too those people went through school for a reason you, you hear me but everything begins and ends with god's mind regarding me and that is how i have been developed how i am being developed regarding this mission of my organization, my business, just be. I don't want to be false on the outside. I don't want to project to the masses and I don't want to project to the public eye what I am not on the inside. So that, that relationship between my soul and my physical prosperity, I want them to, I want them to equal in a sense. I don't want you to look at me and see what you think you see when it's really not what it is on the inside. So I want to be golden on the inside and on the outside. And however God decides to manifest that through me, through physical health, that's what it's got to be because he's my creator. So I got to just beat y'all. Thank y'all.